Hi, in this video we're going to show you some of the better online uh, background image remover tools that you could use. Uh, we're going to start with Adobe Express here. So once you get to the website, just click on Upload Your Photo. You could drag and drop or browse. Let's go to the desktop here. There we go. So we'll try this simple one first with a pretty much solid color background. So I did a really good job of that, nice and clean. Then you could download it. So let's uh, try this again with a more complicated one. All right, so not too bad. You can still see some of the colors on the edges there, but it's actually pretty good. So then you can click on download. All right, so it downloads it there, and then it also uh, opens it in the editor. So if you want to play around with it some more, you could do that. So let's open this. So, so not too bad. Like, like I said, you could still see some of the blue and some of the brown there. So it's pretty good. So you could always go in and try and you know, clean it up uh, with this tool or another tool. All right, so that's there. That. So let's try this next one called Retoucher. Let's upload images. We'll just go right to the complicated one here. You can see it did a good job there. Let's see what happens if we could download it. So about the same as the Adobe one. Not too bad. You know, it's going to be hard to find something that works perfectly when you have all these little fine lines with the dog hair there. So just keep that in mind unless you're you know, using like the real Photoshop, something like that. All right, let's try this Vance AI. Uh, this one here, you only get, I think, three credits, or you could do three a day. Um, you could you know, get more credits, probably have to buy them, but uh, it's just limited on how many free ones you could do. Uh, this one, I'm not sure. Looks like you might be able to do three a day on this as well. The Adobe one was free for as many as you want, I believe. So let's try this. Okay, cut out human or cut out object. And pick object because it's got animal there. This one takes a little more time apparently. So as you can see, if there's jobs in the queue ahead of you, you're, you're going to have to wait. Uh, when I tried this earlier, it was a lot quicker because I guess there was no other. There were no other jobs in the queue. All right, so there's our sample there. You can kind of see it's missed some spots there on the side. All right, let's see if we could download it here. Looks like you need the account to download it. Um, let's just sign in with Google. I don't like doing that, but we'll just do it here. Usually I would make a normal account here. This is a test Google account, so I guess it'll be all right. All right, so now that I signed in, I have three credits again. And now here's my download. So you can see not as good, missed some spots there, and you can see a little more of the glow from the uh, background color there. So that's Vance AI. Okay, now we'll try this Removal AI. Okay, so now we could download or download high quality, which I have a feeling it's going to make you sign up for something if you do that. Yep. Okay, so now looks like we've got to start over again here. So as usual, so if you want, you know, the better quality, you're going to have to pay for it just like with everything else pretty much. So let's just download this. So you can see the picture's a little smaller, but it looks like it did, actually did a better job, even though the file size is actually smaller. You can't see much of the background there. So that's that. So that was Removal AI. Now let's do LunaPix. So this program here, or this site, has all kinds of different uh, things you could do. It's more like a photo editing website here. So it's more than just the uh, transparency thing, but we're just going to do the transparency thing today. So let's upload a photo. So now you should have an option for background removal tools. If you don't see that, you could go to the edit, 
and then auto background removal. But if we go here, you can see you have various uh, options, automatic background removal uh, for logos and graphics, eraser tool if you want to do it manually, signature, if you want to cut something out and then have it be transparent on the, uh, you know, the outside of what you cut out, and some blur options there. So let's just try the automatic. Okay, let's kind of shrink this down here. So it's not too bad. Now let's do the download. So you can still see some of the blue on there as well. So like I said, it's not gonna be perfect when it's a complicated, you know, edge like this. All right, so there's our tools, Lunapic. Removal AI, Vance AI, which you need the account to download apparently, uh, Retoucher, and then Adobe Express. So I'll put links to all these in the description. You could try them all out and see which one works best for you. All right, thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe. Mm -hmm.